Hello friends, so here is another question on simplification of 5 variable SOP or midterm type boolean functions. So this is the function which is given in terms of the variables a, b, c, d, e. Midterm values are 0, 2, 3, 10, 11, 12, 13, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 26, 27. Okay. So first what we'll do, we'll take the function determine or split the variables into two parts okay 0 to 15 range and 16 to 31 range because two separate k-maps will be required so I think here from here 0 to 13 here and then from 16 to 27 here this falls in the 0 to 15 range this falls in the 16 to 31 range. This is the first k map, it will be mapped in the first k map and will be in the second k map. Now, all we have to do is draw the k map and plot the values. Okay, B, C, D, E, A will be taken common, A bar and uh, A. So, the k map, this. this is the k map okay b c d e then 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 same 0 0 0 1 1 1 1 0 then we have b bar c bar b bar c b c b c bar here it is d bar e bar oh sorry it is d bar e okay by mistake i have written here b Okay. okay, it is D bar E bar, here it is D bar E, D E, D E bar. Same format will be used in the second K map also. So, we will simply copy it. But the min term cells will be different. They will be numbered differently because the first one is for a equals to 0 a bar in the msb position and the second k map is for a equals to 1 that is a in the msb position so accordingly the min term values will change so here it is 0 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 here 8 then 9, then 10, then 11, then 12, 13, uh, 14, 15. Again, I tell you, always be careful while numbering the min term cells 0, 1, here it is 2, then 3, then 4, 5, here it is 6, and then 7, then right here at the bottom it will be 8, 9, here 10, 11, then 12, 13, 14, 15. Okay, it is very easy to you know to go with the flow and you can write it 12 13 14 15 one mistake here and there in cell numbering and the whole solution will be wrong similarly here 16 17 18 19 20 21 22 23 here it is 24 25 26 27 28 29, 30, 31. Okay, now we have to plot the min term values in these k maps 0 to 15 range. The values are 0, 2, 3, 10, 11, 12, 13. 0, 2, 3, 10, 11, 12, 13. This. 
so we have to form groups okay first let us plot then we'll form the groups then 16 17 18 19 20 21 16 17 18 19 20 21 then 26 27 26 27 okay so we have mapped the values now we will form the groups for the first k map this focus on cells 2 3 10 11 we can form a quad here then focus on cells 12 13 we can form a pair then focus on cells 0 and 2 okay 0 and 2 we can form another pair here okay this then going to the second k map here focus on cells 16 17 20 21 we can form a quad here then okay this then focus on cells 26 27 then 18 19 26 27 18 19 we can form another quad here and then focus on cells 16 and 18 we can form a pair here why we are forming this pair c in this k map 0 and 2 cells 0 and 2 they have a pair in the same way in the identical position like 16 and 18 in the second k map so one thing is for sure that the common variables from these two group it will come in the minimized expression that's why we have formed this group okay so now we have to identify the common variables okay for the first k map for the quad involving 2 3 10 11 it is on the horizontal side it is c bar and the vertical side it is d so here it is c bar D. the horizontal side c bar here and here the vertical side it is dt c bar d so i have already told you how to form groups that is pairs quads octets how to identify the common variables in detail i have explained in the three variable and four variable k map questions so please watch those videos first okay c bar d then for this pair the common variable in the horizontal side is bc the vertical side is d bar bc d bar is common then for this pair the common variable is b bar c bar and on the vertical side e bar b bar c bar e bar okay this then on this side for the quad involving 18 19 26 27 c bar on the horizontal side d on the vertical side so c bar d then for this quad involving cells 16 17 20 21 it is b bar on the horizontal side d bar on the vertical side b bar d bar then for this pair involving cells 16 and 18 it is b bar c bar on the horizontal side and e bar on the vertical side b bar c bar e bar okay now so for the first k map the minimized boolean expression is the common variables are c bar d okay let me write it here c bar d or b c d bar then b bar c bar e bar b bar c bar e bar okay and we will end it with a bar because a bar is common that is the first minimized boolean expression for the first k map then for the second k map the common variables are c bar d or b bar d bar then b bar c bar e bar okay 
b bar c bar e bar okay here we will take a as common in the and and this will be the second minimized boolean expression okay this now the final minimized boolean expression will be the sum of both that is a bar c bar d or a bar b c d bar or a bar b bar c bar e bar here it will be a c bar d or a b bar d bar or a b bar c bar e bar now focus on a bar c bar d and a c bar d in these two here it is a bar here it is a c bar d if you take common it will be a or a bar finally the minimized boolean expression will come c bar d next focus on a bar b bar c bar e bar and a b bar c bar e bar here it is a here it is a bar in these two if we take b bar c bar e bar common again it will be a or a bar it will be b bar c bar e bar common it will come in the final minimized boolean expression next there is nothing common i think there is nothing common so it will be simply a b bar d bar or a bar b c d bar this is the final minimized boolean expression so like i said in the previous question also the trick here is that c i told you if you compare the two k maps c 2 3 10 11 this quad and here 18 19 26 27 this quad both of them have c bar d in common okay the common set of variables because one k map is for a bar another one for a so finally when we minimize it it will come in the form of c bar d a or a bar and it will be equal to c bar d so you can say without any doubt that c bar d will come in the final minimized boolean expression similarly if you see the pair 0 2 okay 0 2 in the first k map and 16 and 18 in the second k map we have b bar c bar e bar common because the pair the groups is at identical positions okay this min term cell values are different but the position in the k map it is the same in terms of the variables here it is b bar c bar here it is e bar in the vertical side same thing here so if we you know take it for the final minimization it will come in the form of b bar c bar e bar and a or a bar like this and it will be finally equal to b bar c bar e bar so without any doubt you can say when you find groups at identical positions okay in the two k maps you can say that that common variable okay that common variable will appear in the final minimized boolean expression like this c bar d and b bar c bar e bar have appeared directly in the final minimized boolean expression remaining are you have to do the minimization things okay so this is another question related to five variable sop k map which we have solved